guys welcome back to my channel so today I have a really fun video it is my favorite fall lipsticks and I am gonna categorize them into like browns and neutrals some deep dark reds and some dark plums and um, vampy lips in the fall are my absolute favorite like I wear them all year round like I kind of have an obsession but fall is the time that you can get away with it and if you're not used to wearing um, a brighter lip or bold say you wear kind of neutrals now is the time to do it do it be bold it's fall what could be better than fall and lipstick I mean come on I guess Starbucks too like their cute little fall cups oh. okay so <laughs> let's get started so starting off with just um, some like really neutral um, browns. They're really pretty. First I have um, Gerard Cosmetics 1995 and this is just a really pretty um, like brown, mauve neutral. Um, Jaclyn Hill created it with Gerard Cosmetics to be a um, Kylie Jenner lip color. As you can see, very pretty. I love it. Next we have Touch of Spice. Um, this is Maybelline's matte collection and this is pretty similar. It just has, um, it's the second one in, it has um, a little bit more pink versus 1995, has a little bit more peach tones in it. Okay, so lastly, um, this lipstick is from BH Cosmetics, and it's in the same color family as the other two. And I just really enjoy these colors for fall. They're just super easy and versatile, and you can wear them with, like, any look. I personally like them with a, like, smoked-out brown eye for fall, but they're really great for everyday wear. And all of these are mattes, and all of them are fairly inexpensive, um, like... 15 and under. I know Gerard Cosmetics is a little bit more pricey and you can only get that online, but um, actually same with this, but this was like $5 and then this Maybelline was probably like 6 Okay, so next we're going to move on to some reds and these are all very dark reds, perfect for fall. They're very vampy. So this first one is from Colourpop Cosmetics and it is in E Lair and it just looks like this. It's just like a fun little stick and it's super easy to apply. I personally don't use a liner with this just because it's so dark you really don't need it. But it is this first one right there and it is just a really pretty dark red and um, like I said super easy to apply and it's five dollars you guys you can't go wrong so I can link them down below next is um, this Mary Kay deep red and it is in midnight red I actually had to buy this um, when I was in dance team in high school um, we use this for our kick line but this is just right in the middle here sorry this is kind of hard to see um, but that's just more of a, um, a darker red. It has a little bit more brown in it than um, plum. So this is also really gorgeous for fall. And then lastly is my favorite of all these reds. It is Lime Crimes Velveteen in Wicked. It looks like that. And it is a, um, a liquid lip stain. So you apply it apply it apply it you apply it to your lips like a normal lipstick but it locks in and it is there like forever and sometimes it gets a little flaky on the inside that's kind of a downside but it's super super dark and vampy and it is my favorite if you ever see me like in any of the pictures I post on Instagram or anything in a super dark like red vampy lip it's usually this one because I love it Okay, next moving on to the purples, and I just have three of these, and then that's it. Okay, so this one is by Laura Geller, and it is a um, kind of like a fuchsia pinky plum, so it's going to be a little bit more bold, because once it starts wearing off, it gets a little bit um, like fuchsia-y, pinky, um, so it totally depends on like what your kind of style is. If you're going for like a really bold, um, brighter fall lip with like a simple eye, this is a really good one. And I think this was $18. I got it at Ulta. And this is called Broadway Plum. <laughs> so of course I loved it and I had to buy it. 
This next lipstick is from Sephora. It is their brand, Sephora. And this is another liquid lip stain. And this is in number four. I guess it's just called number four. But it's a really, 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 really pretty plum. Um, and this, I think, is just so beautiful. It's like a true, um, like, brownie purple. Why can't I find it? There it is. Yeah. Gorgeous. I love this. And this is matte as well. All of these are matte except for this Laura Geller. Um, I just kind of have an obsession with matte lipsticks. I think it's just because I have um, oily skin, so I kind of just like the all matte look. Um, I just think it's really appealing, and especially for fall, it's just like, it's gorgeous. I love it, especially with a deep, dark lipstick. It just looks really great. And then lastly, you guys have seen me wear this and talk about this before, but it is Max Diva. And this is, like, by far the best out of all, like, plum lipsticks. It's a winner for sure. Can you see that? This last one there. It's so hard to work reverse on this camera. I'm like, <laughs> But, yeah, it is so, so, so pretty. And I absolutely love it. I always keep purchasing it. And it's called Diva. So, like, what a fun name. And yeah, that is it, you guys. That is my top nine, I guess, um, lipsticks. So I really enjoy wearing like the neutrals, the browns, um, deep dark reds, and plums. Those are my three favorite for fall, and I really hope you enjoyed this video. Like it and comment down below um, what you thought and any other fall suggestions. I'd like to um, do a fall like fashion essentials um, coming up. So hopefully that'll be up next week, but I'll let you guys know. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.